Georgians are looking for a symbol for who they are, how they feel, the, the spirit of the nation. Georgia keeps coming back to the vine, to grapes, and, and ultimately to wine. Kakheti and its surrounding vineyards have been producing natural wine for eight millennia. But the Red Army invasion of 1921 led to wholesale destruction and the introduction of mass production techniques to produce cheap wine for Russia. Recovery since independence in 1991 has been slow, but Georgian wine has at least one champion. To make his wine, John uses time-honoured techniques and these terracotta vessels called quevery. Here we are at our original cellar. These are the, the quevery. quevery. The fact that they're buried in the earth, there's a whole philosophy behind that. You know, the earth gives us the grapes, we crush them into the quevery, and the earth is warm at the time of harvest, so spontaneous fermentation happens easily. And then we seal the top, and we keep it there until spring. But uh, Georgians have been doing it for more than 8,000 years. Can I have a go? Yeah, Can I get please, make anymore? yourself at home. It's strange to think that wine was being made this way 3,000 years before even the pyramids were built. It's cool as well. It's like stepping into a, not quite a fridge, but a sort of cool room, like a, a storeroom somewhere. 